Hi everyone, I'm JD from Willow Bound Journals. Here are some bird junk journal embellishment ephemera packs that I had fun putting together. So a little while ago I made my last collection of bird journals and a final embellished bird journal. Now I was planning to make some more journals actually out of these covers that I had made last year and I had fun embellishing this using different items from Your Creative Studio, a bird box, and I believe I did do a tutorial and shared a process video of how I made these collages. And my original plan was to turn this into a journal cover, and if not a journal cover, then an embellishment pack where you could put goodies inside. So there are two types of packs here. There's a large deluxe pack, I'm calling it, and then there's a smaller pack with, instead of a double envelope, we've got a single one that you could yourself turn into a cover if you wanted, or just keep as an envelope and put some goodies inside. So considering that I've already done a bird collection and went out with a bang with my final embellished journal, I am ready to move on from the bird theme. So basically I am using all the things now, uh, all the things I've been hoarding, like these vintage playing cards and beautiful postage stamps and things, I am now parting with either in the journals I'm making or with these packs. And so, yeah, I thought I would share these packs in case anyone else was inspired to make their own bird journals. And I've just included all of the things that I would use to make my own bird journal. So with the added bonus of the embellished envelope. I think these are so beautiful. I love them. It took me a while to make up these packs because I was, yeah, I was hoarding these. But just to give you an idea of what comes in them, and the only difference besides the envelope is that these smaller packs come with a few, uh, a few, a few less items, but not too many less. <laughs> uh, so we've got some bird pages here. These would look familiar. I've used those in all of my bird journals from the collection that I made this year. I believe there are two left in my Etsy um, of those bird journals. I've used these pages in my bird journals as well. We get a nice variety and you get some of the vintage music paper, which I used in my journals. So I love that because it reminds me of bird singing and bird song. A doily, always a fun type of page to use. And then we have this gorgeous page with all different types. Uh, so these packs are in my Etsy if you are interested. Uh, this one here with the blue wren, each of them have, have a different bird but the same type of page. Love this gorgeous page here, isn't that beautiful? So you could fold that in half and turn that into a page which is what I would do. Or you could cut it up. <laughs> uh, this lovely card as well which you could either use as a piece of ephemera or as a page in your journal. I've uh, got this lovely one here with some lavender and the birds just remind me of, you know, sky and flying and that kind of thing. And then here we have a um, embellished envelope that I did using uh, tissue paper and I love using that as an interactive pocket page. So all the feature pages are there. All you need is your own, you know, blank writing pages, whether it's coffee dye paper, colored paper, white paper, but all the feature pages are there. And then all the embellishments are there that I would use. So I've got some of these napkin envelopes. I love this one with the rainbow feathers, the peacocks, and then some handmade goodies that are included as well. One of my handmade envelopes and some handmade journal cards. This one made out of a collage with vintage papers and I believe they've each got some sort of bird on them. And another embellished journal card. And then some extra goodies because I just like including extra goodies. So these ones you can turn into pockets or put into pockets. And again, just put into pockets or this one could be sewn into a pocket. Love using these items as little extras in my own personal journals that I make. And of course, a library card is always fun to use. We've got <laughs> more goodies here, smaller things. Tickets and vellum and I love this playing card it's so so hard to part with some of these things but yeah this year it's all about letting go and moving on and using the treasures these are just gorgeous more vintage cards another vintage card and a postage stamp so 
yeah, I hope that I can pass these on to someone else who can make use of these and get a lot of joy out of making your journals from these. I won't go through everything here. It's very similar. Um, same amount of stuff with the deluxe, just a few items with the smaller packs. But as you can see, like the same things, tickets and um, embellishments, cards, all same vintage items are there and papers and pages and doily and music paper and all that kind of stuff. So if you like the bird theme and would like to make your own bird journal or if you just want to use the ephemera and use them in your personal journaling or scatter them in different journals, this is a great stash for you. So yeah, love putting them together. They're so colorful, beautiful. It's a bit painful to have to part with them, but uh, yeah, I'm done. I'm done making my bird journals now and uh, it's time for someone else to use these supplies to make your own bird themed journals or ephemera. Maybe you want to make your own handmade ephemera and embellishments. But yeah, hope someone else can get a lot of joy out of this. That's that's the thing that's letting me pass these on, which is yeah, it's painful to let some of these pass on. But if someone else can get joy out of these, that's the main thing. <laughs> Alright guys, so uh, they're in my Etsy as I said. Check out the link below for my Etsy shop, Willow Band Journals, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks, Back thank you to my beautiful patrons who supported me in January. If you would like to become a patron in February, and the link is down below, and you, that is where you get access to extra videos, all my printables, all my digital kits in my Etsy. There are post tiers, mail tiers, and journal tiers as well. There is a Marco Polo tier and just lots of fun stuff over there. There is also a link to all of my available courses down below in the description box. You can join those anytime for all of my Patreon and courses. They're monthly subscriptions that work just like Netflix or Spotify and you're charged on the date that you sign up and you can cancel anytime.